Hello everyone, today is going to be epic because it is new bike day! <laughs> Look at this beauty! This is the high bike All Mountain 3 and it is a machine! So stoked on it! We're here at Twisted Oaks Bike Park today to give it its first maiden voyage and you know I thought I'd just build it up first, you don't have to watch all the boring allen key twisting but we're going to do a mini bike check before we get into the action. Uh, we got some fresh halo wheels on there, absolutely lovely. So when I land sideways I know they're not going to buckle. This is actually a mullet bike so we got a 29er wheel on the front, 27.5 on the rear. The theory behind it is that a bigger wheel kind of flattens out bumps because that is just what it does. So when you're going flat out downhill, it's going to be smoother on this machine. Uh, I've got a Der Kaiser Continental front tyre. And then for the rear, I've got the Continental Trail King in 2.6. So it's a bit fat, more like moto style there. We've got some Carda Tech pedals on, looking lovely. So thanks to those guys for giving them to me last year. We got obviously pill grips on. I mean, who wouldn't have pill grips on a bike, you know? Ah, oh, so much control and feeling. We got some Shimano brakes on there. We got some sort of Shimano gearing. Nope, SRAM. So we got RockShock Yetis on the front and on the rear we've got the RockShock Dulux which is similar sounding to the paint brand. For all that uphill comfort I've got an Ergon SM Enduro Pro Tie Saddle. So you've got these awesome tie bits of metal here, titanium, looking lovely, petrol dipped colour and just very comfortable and helpful when you're pedalling uphill. The bike has a 625 watt hour battery, so that's going to power you all day for a lot of fun and excitement. With the Bosch CX motor to give you all that torque and uphill power you need. But I think that is actually all we need to look at because I'm ready for Shreddy. And who wants to listen to me talking all day? No one! Let's ride! I'm a, I'm a walking lick, having nothing on my wrist. Paparazzi taking pics, something you don't want to miss. I'm a, I'm a walking lick, private jet for the trip, private dance cause the whip, something you don't wanna miss. Diamonds dance that you got served, think you the one but you not the first, crash the rake, we swang and swerve, her head is straight while I drive in reverse. Yeah. Here we go then, first trail about to be dropped on my new bike, see how it goes. Well, that's the dream. This thing feels absolutely amazing. Brand new, no noises, super smooth. Loving it. So we're now gonna go up here into the endless trail selection they have and hit another one. Let's. Right, here we go then. Straight into this little skinny line. And then cruising down into the fun bit. Little Manny. Whoa, yeah. Into these little drops. Whew, wow, that is so fun. I actually love the 29 on the front of this. Haven't like cared about it too much in the past, but it is good. It does take away some of the impacts, and I can go to flat on stuff like up there and not really notice it too much and the big 2.6 Conti on the back giving me so much grip actual dreams I think it's time to hit a few of the bigger jumps in this woods so let's just head over there we're now over at a different trail this has got some bigger gaps 
huge wall ride if you accidentally went out the berm like the guy we just watched a minute ago and it looks like a lot of fun so let's drop straight in oh here we go into the line cruising in Now, as we all know, e-bikes are heavier than analog or norms, as I like to call them, bikes without motors. Uh, but really, you don't even feel the weight. It's actually, like I've always said, better to jump an e-bike because that weight keeps you level in the air. And even if you land a bit sideways and stuff, it all just straightens out quicker. It's just such a weird feeling. It's like, it's like you're given magic powers when you get on an e -bike because you can just go bigger, land more sideways, and just go harder. So fun. We're gonna do a quick lap through the dirt jumps there, and then put on the goats, chase Louis around on his Ebe. So let's go and have a look. Into the jump line, dropping. There we go, what a dream. A few little steezers then. And Cardi's just arrived, look. Woohoo! So we're gonna do a few GoPro runs now, Louis, Cardi, and Cara. Whoa! So let's get into some action. Right, here we go, we're gonna do the duel. We got Cara, Cardi joining us, Lubes. Yep. Cara's gonna lead by a little bit, and then we're gonna oh, just yeah. like knock you off or something on one of the berms. How much of a head start do I get then? Like until I get to that gate, I reckon? Like, nah, actually only halfway. You'll be all right down there. Yeah, get it. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Catch the Cara. Oh, she's well away. Oh, yeah, we're catching this as well, good. Overtaking Louis. Yes, we've got the Cara. Chasing cards. Oh Boom. Oh, that was well good. It's so fun that track, isn't it? Yeah. Here we go. Into the growler. Sick line chasing lubes. Huge. Catching ya. Oh, fully catching. Oh. Oh yeah! Oh! Almost a car at overtake. Got a loop. Yes. Ah, oh, well good. What a ladsy lassie train that was. Do you wanna go far left, Lou? Or something? Or cards and and I'll go on this inside gap or something. Yeah, get it. Let's try this four cross out then. Oh. <laughs> That's well good. That's going to be sick. We're now over at rum trousers for a bit of fun aren't we louie can lead on then get it got any cards car are you following car is in for some huge tricks behind oh this line's so fun Flying down. Yeah, it is actually amazing. I wish it was like triple the length. Yeah. Oh. We just come back in from the woods then. It's got dark very fast. Winter is actually not that fun because you just forget 
how fast it gets dark. But what a fun session it's been on this beautiful all mountain. Loving the 29er up front. Awesome to be on a bike that doesn't creak all day like my jump bike. Sorry for that, everyone. I will get new cranks eventually. But yeah, what a machine. Absolutely loving it. Can't wait for some big missions on this in the future. So I reckon we need to go somewhere steep, fast and dangerous soon, Lou. Does anyone know of anywhere? Let us know. But on that bombshell of absolute fun and excitement with the squad in the end and the new bike, that is the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That'd be awesome if you leave some comments and if you sick if you subscribe. See you in the next one. <laughs>